this thing on? Hello everybody and welcome back to Feed the Beast Infinity Evolved Expert Mode with Techno Jock. My word Techno, you're in your reactor room. Why on earth are you down there? Surely you've grown out of such primitive technology, I hear you say. Well, there's a couple of things that I need down here and if you have a look in my in inventory bar you will see what they are. Uh, yes, I need myself a couple of uranium-238 to be able to make these reactant dynamos. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to get changed back into our civilian clothes and head on up. Because if you recall last episode, I said I needed iron. Lots of iron. And I need to go on an adventure to do so. Now, I don't particularly want to have to walk and my jetpack's pretty good but it's not as good as it could be and we've got to the point where we can make an awful lot better than what we already have so if i go into my inventory and take off my hardened jetpack and put it into my crafting frame i can take the ar uh, the armor off of that and we've now got our hardened jetpack hardened jetpack next tier up is the reinforced jetpack and it takes this stuff, takes the hardened jetpack, redstone flux capacitor, these re thruster things, which we can see we've got everything apart from the thrusters. The thrusters need those reactant dynamos. Put them there, and we need a couple of buckets of redstone. Now, redstone, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's eleven. Misclicked. Right, and I think I have a bucket on me, so we'll just do two trips, doesn't really matter. And we'll go pop that in there, oh, oh I thought, why put that in there? I can't even remember what I was trying out, just goes to show. Let's pop that there, one reinforced thruster. Uh, we need to put that in there, go back and get our other bucket. Perfect. Pop that in there. We've got two thrusters. Let's make our reinforced jetpack. Ooh, it keeps the fact that it's soul bound. Excellent. I'm extremely pleased with that. I was all prepared to have to use the other Soulbound book that we got last episode. Right. Um, why not? Let's go for the resonant one. Uh, okay, so we need... We need a resonant flux capacitor. We don't have everything apart from the actual capacitor. I think I need to make one like that. Oops. The hardened one, please. Like that. Like that. And like that. Gosh, this makes it so much easier doing this. Okay, what do we need for those thrusters? We need innervation dynamos. We need electrum gears. Okay, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four for the gears. Let's toddle over here. Let's put them into melt. I've got an idea for a cool gear, gear making machine as well, but it's going to be a little while before we get to that point. But we don't really need automated gears quite yet. Or, well, we've got automated gears, but we don't need to automate it to that level. There's something in that corner that's killing my frame rate. Okay, so um, the resonant. What else didn't we have? We don't have resonant flux ducts, and we need indium gears and petrothium petrothium dust. Okay, obsidian dust and destabilized redstone. Okay, and we need. Two. So one lot of that. Yeah, one lot of that will make two. And this stuff we can make by infusing that. So I need two redstone, one. 
let's see about this stuff. And two redstone, obsidian dust. Not done this before. This stuff is new to me. Let's put that in there, that in there. There we go. Okay. Um, so, like that. Okay. And then, like that. Okay, we need Dendirium gear. And, since we're making gears, these ones should be done, I think. They certainly are. Now, hold on, don't I need four of them? Yes, I certainly do. And, uh, Electrum. Let's go back over there and make the other four of these. That's the last gear pouring now. Should harden in just a moment. Perfect. Let's take these. Heading over here. Right, so we have six resonant flux ducts there. Like that. I need... No, I need... And I need my bucket again. Thank you. Let's go back over here. So, where are we? We are at the point of making these. What was it? No, it wasn't that. Clearly. That. Two innervation dynamos. Um, and I need some snow. Oh, wow, just that. Okay. One, and then the other one in the other bucket. This is how much quicker crafting is when you've got an AE system. I just love it. There we go. We've got one resonant jetpack. Oh yeah. Now, flux and flu infused jet plate. What would be required for one of these? We would need our resonant jetpack. With the armor on it. Okay. Need one of these coolant units. That's easy enough. Probably got the stuff to make that. Okay, I need flux electrum. Electrum. Let's grind up a stack of that. Because if we're in the big upgrading mood, let's uh, let's see about upgrading stuff, eh? So we'll get a bunch of that in. We may as well just make a. Oh, we've got flux electrum blend there. Okay then. We don't actually need the f electrum blend now. Never mind. Right. I think if I make half a stack of this stuff into it, um, that's not quite enough. Okay then. We'll be able to make 28, and that'll be plenty. I think... I think my maths might well have worked there. Oh my word, it's the first time ever. So let's have a look at... Come on, chop-chop. Um, so we need two of these. Yep. I need cryothem to go in them. Flux thrusters. I need another two resonant thrusters. Okay, well we can do that. 
we've got the stuff. Need to make some more electrum gears, but that's fine. We need these close to an elevation yet. Okay. This is doable. Alright, let's make... What is it again? There it is. Um, we've got those. That's fine. We need to fill them up with the cryothium, jelly cryothium, cryothium dust. I think I need blizz powder. Yeah, I do. Um, which is snowballs and redstone. I've got snowballs over there. Um, stack of snowballs. I will do like this. Using my oh yep yeah, made these. That's for the fluxed electrum plates or whatever they're called. Let's get rid of that. Perfect, that will give us plenty of this stuff to make cryothium dust. And how much of that stuff do we need? Four buckets worth. Four buckets worth is... Really, what one gives 100, so we need 10 of these for a bucket. And we need two buckets. No, four buckets. For each. So we need, f we need an awful lot more than that. I think that's that. Now, if we take these over to the transposer, hopefully. Okay, how have we got extra? I measured that out. How have, how have we got extra? Tell me this. Honestly, I'm going to need to get some sort of drum or something now. Anyway, right. Let's get on with the next bit. So we've got those bits. We need these bits. And let's make that. That. Need that hardened glass. Okay. Let me get all the bits of this together because it's not that interesting watching me click through NEI and my system here. Just getting the last indelium gear that we require for this. Which, there we go, we've got that. And if we put this in here to get another set of these resonant flux ducts, we should now pretty much have what we require. We can do that. Perfect. Put it in there. This. Perfect. Do two of those. Excellent. And then, bam, we've got it. So we had our flux infused, infused jet chest plate before. Um, these things you saw me make, we made our way up to our resonant jetpack, I put the armor on it. This thing, the resonant flux packs, uh, are just these things and each preceding one requires the tier before it, blah blah blah, and the fluxed thruster. Let's do that then. Let's come out of here and put it on. How do we look? How do we look? Oh yeah. Yeah, we look pretty sweet. Yes, we do. Okay. It is not... Yeah, we. it has not got soul bound on it, so we need to soul bound this thing. Soul bound? Soul bound? Yes, soul bound. Yep. Wrong thing. There we go. Let's get that, put it on, and we will be golden. Because I definitely, definitely don't want to lose this at any point. Keep on forgetting, I've moved my anvil over here. Let's take this, put it in here with the book. Excellent. Everything looking all shiny. Maybe we should 
do the helmet as well to make it shiny as well, but never mind. Let's have a look and see how this works. Let's put the hover on. Oh yeah! Let's uh, pop outside with this thing. Oh yeah, that's going to be good. The uh, thruster sounds perhaps a little bit loud. I might need to turn that down. But that's pretty handy. We are now ready to go on our adventure. I'm going to take one of these buckets with me. In fact, why don't I just take two because they stack? That would be sensible, wouldn't it? I um, think I've got everything I need with me. I'm going to take my bow. Won't need that. That. There we go. Um, and shouldn't need that at the moment. Yep. Um, let's rock. Let's go spawn village. There we go. I'm going to turn that off for the moment. And yes, we are in the Twilight Forest because I'm looking for something in particular. Um, let me turn down the sound a little bit. I don't know which one's going to count. I'll turn that down and then see. I think that did make a difference, didn't it? Yes. This is the player sound. I think that's adequate. And now, let's go looking. Let's go looking in this direction, I think. Whoa! Okay, we're going to need to wait for this to load in. Right, and I shall come back when I have found what I am looking for. I am finally where I need to be in the Twilight Forest. It's taken me quite some time to get this far. I had to go through the other zones first, and this one is in the Dark Forest. So I had to um, go through the Minotaur's Labyrinth and kill the big um, mushroom, mushroom centaur dude. Um, I then had to kill the Hydra. I then had to go through... Um, the dark forest labyrinth maze thing as well and put the Carmenite knights to rest so this has got me this far now I want to steer clear of those guys Billy I don't have any yeah this shows you how much I've done because I don't actually have any bolts left missed me haha <laughs> um, yeah so I don't want to Oh, I'm gonna have to take care of him, aren't I? Oh, excellent. Oh, well, at least I got that. That's pretty cool. So, yeah, I want to go in through the main body of the tower, which isn't that bit. Is it? Oh, what's this? What's. Ah! Well, oh, that's the Urgast. Okay, so that's the boss. I don't want to mess with him because I can't really kill him at the moment. Alright, so I need to go in through the main body of the tower, which is over here. Um, now, I can never remember where in the tower this is. So let's go in through here. Cheating outrageously by going in through the side and using flight here, but I've been through this bit too many times before to really be bothered by it. Okay, so I can't build here. That's cool. Um, yeah, I don't know what this bit is. don't think it's this bit I want to be in, anyway. It's very dark in here. I'm sure you guys can't see anything, either. Um, not an awful lot I can do about it being dark, other than put down some torches. Right, let's see if I can get down to another bit. Here. Let's see. 
In case you haven't guessed already, I'm in here looking for a Carmelite Golem. I think this is going to take me to outside. I need more torches. Um, and the Carmelite Golems, aha, are in this area, I think. Pretty sure they are. Something coming my way. I need some torches. I don't have anything to make torches from. I wonder if there's anything in here that would be helpful, like a torch. Really? Uh, if I use my axe, it's going to. Actually, no, if I use my axe, it's going to destroy that bit instead. Oh, it's going to destroy absolutely everything in the known world. Hey! Right, um... Yeah, I'd quite like... Don't want to be messing with the Urgast. Let me come back once I've actually found this thing. Well, I found one of the things that I was here for. One of these little Carmenite Gastlings. That's perfect. I've captured one in a soul vial. So I can... Um... Cap capture these guys and uh, they'll be really cool for for spawning in. Now I know that Stalker's already got one for spawning in but I thought it'd be quite cool to have another little one. Um, and I want to get rid of some of this rubbish on me. I have found what I am looking for. We have a Carmenite Golem over here and if I whoop, pop him in there Excellent. We have one Carmenite Golem in here, and we're going to make a spawner out of this. I did find the spawner over there, and he spawned, and I thought I would quickly bring you back so we could go through this. And you can see there's lots of these spider things here, which don't appear to be poisonous, I think. I certainly haven't been poisoned by one yet. But there's an actual spawner there, which we may use, but I don't think we really need it at the moment. Let's go home. So what we will do is, I think we will reuse this thing. We're going to set this up with um, that Carmenite Golem in it, and then we're going to see if we can get ourselves um, a soul from that. And then once we get ourselves a soul, we are sorted. Um, I think what I'll do though is I'll need to do this off camera and get the soul and uh, yeah we'll need to call it a day because I think we are running a little bit long. And um, Let me just check. Yeah we don't really have the time unfortunately or shall we? Yeah let's quickly let's quickly make the spawner and then we'll do that. Let's grab this and this out of here. Oh my word, I've got so much rubbish on me. And I'll need that. Put them in there. That in there, a little bit of inventory management because we can go, I uh, don't need that. Uh, that'll be sorted, that'll be sorted. I need to do something, my bolts are completely de depleted. Uh, that should do this just now, right? Let's go in here and take that off there. Come on, let me get out. Oh, I think it's because it's there. We go, perfect. Right, let's go. We need to get ourselves a broken spawner, which we should have here. We've got plenty of broken spawners. Which ones shall we use? We've got stabilized mob spawner ready to go for that. Let's take our Carmenite Golem and this and stick them together. Oh, we've already got a broken spawner in there. 15 levels. Should have that on me. Superb. Let's put some more stuff back in here. That can go back in there. That can be cleared. That's going in there. Um, all this stuff can be... 
what stuff do we have on us that I want to keep? Charcoal can go over here. Perfect. And we'll saw up some of these sticks. Cool. How long is this going to take? Hmm. Ages and ages. If I don't nick that. Do I have another octadic capacitor I can put in there briefly? Um, let's just get rid of all of this. Octadic capacitor. What do I need? I need double layered capacitors. I need single layered capacitors. And there we go, that'll do nicely. Put that in there, excellent. Nearly there, nearly there. And the other thing I was going to do with those tower planks was going to do something like that. Get rid of them because we don't really want these tower wood planks taking up all the space. And um, no. And these cracked ones. Perfect. Let's go like that. Put them back in there. I think our spawner is done. It is. So, take our powered spawner over to our anvil. We've got plenty levels on us. One powered spawner with a carmonite golem gives us our carmonite golem spawner. And if we do that, somewhere we will have our sword with reaper on it. Perfect. And I'm so happy, I'm just going to throw my golden bag of holding around. So let's put this back in here. Like that. Let's reverse out through the door. And go... Shielding up, spawner on. There we go. That, that's what we want. So, where do you think you're going? Well, folks, I think that is the point at which we wrap up for today. I'm going to whack the ankles of these guys and get ourselves um, a mob soul, and then I'm going to make a spawner for our iron. And when we come back next time, you'll see exactly how good we are doing for our iron. I'm down, chaps. Um, but until the next time, it's a bye bye from me, and have a fun. Don't forget... Like and subscribe if you liked it, and if you haven't already subscribed, and do check out the other Season Gamers. They're doing cool stuff, I promise. See you next time, chaps, and chapheads.